Hey guys, how's it going? JD here. I'm just doing some demo trading here. You know, you never can get too much practice. And so I looked at the Audi Swiss. It was running up on the day chart four hour and hour. As soon as I came here, it was starting to break out. So I boxed this up real quick. And so I'm, what's our trade? Breakout pullback. But this thing just took off. Um, but there's nothing but, nothing but uh, blue skies ahead though. So we'll just look for entry. Again, this is just just demo practice, but you can never get too much practice in. So, you know, if you finish your trading day early or something like that and hey, get some practice in, you know, just do some chart reading, um, which is actually better than taking taking real trades. So you can start to see really read what the market is doing um, on a steel chart before you know, you're trading in a live or demo account. But you no, know, we've had a pretty good move up here. It ranged. Short time, couldn't get through, couldn't get through, couldn't get through the bottom. Broke out the top. This is this is classic here. Full bar breakout. That's that's what we want to see there. So up oh, here come Titan, so it's gonna get noisy, but Yep, so what we'll be looking for is a pullback. Hopefully we can get a pullback and then some type of entry, but it is, it has taken off. No. So I'll come back if we get an entry. All right. So this thing just, I mean, it took off, you know, took off. So I'm kind of thinking rally base rally with the strength of these bars here. And then we've kind of had two, two attempts back i mean these two falling hammers so we should be coming back and if we come back that's just even actually better uh the closer it gets to the to this range to test it one more time to the ema the better again the best entries are always off the ema so the closer it comes down that would be the better but if it just um turns and we get a candle that crosses the buddy's highs i'll go with it because just due to the strength of this leg um I would be expecting another leg of this distance or or better but it's got to be a strong bar like this that's too weak that's 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 a weak signal candle and it could work but it's weak i mean it didn't close on this top there's no body there this is basically a doji and we skip dojis as far as signal candles go now but on the flip side not really flip side you can see this is a first leg though like a down up and then another down which would turn this into a second entry long setup you could ain't the greatest second entry at uh, at all but you could look at it that way 17 seconds yeah we want this to push down get a little closer to the now that ema is above that range that's good I really would like it to come down and touch the EMA. It's not going to do it. Again, too little. I mean, this, you know, you may be tempted now, but that's almost a doji too. It got a little bit more body than the first candle, but nothing to write home about. But it definitely made the a leg. So if it pushes down strong, hard, that'd be great for a second entry possibly right off this EMA. It's not a rally base rally anymore. We can take that off the table. So um, the best we can hope for is a second entry, unless it just takes off to. Now, again, I like strength. You know, I like strength, I like big bars. This thing takes off and crosses here as a new high. I'll go with it, assuming that we're gonna get another leg, you know, like this run. And again, we've already checked the day chart for hour and hour. There's nothing, there's nothing up here. Like nothing, like go to the left. You can't even find, oh, oh look. Okay, we're trying to break above here. Yeah, we get over those highs, we are gone. We are gone. This would be the target. 
Oh, it's making the second entry. Perfect. This is the high. First entry. Came down. Broke lower than all these. Cool. Now we got a second entry in play. Yep. So we wouldn't be trying to enter on this bar. We would have to wait for the next bar. Uh, unless this bar just shoots the rockets up somehow. Which would be a, a show of buyer strength. And we would go with that strength. Huh. I didn't really think it was going to do it, but uh, it's doing it. I got to go with the strength. I'm in. Ah, dud it out on my clothes. I would have got a better clothes if I had waited because I would enter here. Since it's a demo, let's do that too so we can see if, uh, if you know, if this one don't work and this one works, we'll just be able to see the difference in the two. I mean, it's a first entry. It's definitely a second entry long. Only problem is it didn't happen off the EMA. You know, you, you again, I mean, I said it earlier already. Your best entries are off the EMA. So we'll see. I mean, the way this pushed up, they, they got me on this one. They trapped, trapped me here. I did not expect that the wrist pushed up. I did not expect a huge, I did not expect this huge. I wanted this huge candle to be this one. They all called. But now we got like nothing. Like this is this formation here is uh nothing. Come on. Come back. Let's, let's see a comeback win here. But here is a, uh, you know, you should pr you should practice how you're going to play. And normally I wait for the candle to close unless it, I wait for it to get through, you know, wait for it to get through the high, not just get to it, get through it, then enter. So I probably, there's a good chance I would have skipped this because of the way this candle closed and we wouldn't even been in and we'd be about to enter in right here on this third candle. I'm gonna do that to see how that would have worked out. This would have been my entry candle because this is the first entry, second entry. This is the second entry long. But we got 42 seconds to get up here. We're about to see if we can do it. Thirty-two seconds to get all the way to the top. Twenty three seconds to get all the way to the top. Fifteen seconds to get all the way to the top. Ten seconds. Six, four, three, two. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. That was close. Eight seconds to win that second trade. Oh, it's kind of come back four seconds. Pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. Lost that one too. Yep, so this was just the, the wrong candle uh, to enter on. But as we see, first entry, wait for the strong push. You know, don't enter here. This is the second entry. This one that we're in right now is the, is the legitimate second entry. It's much closer to the EMA. It's much closer to the EMA. See, entering up here, that was away from the EMA. Your best entries are on or near this 21 EMA, as you see. So we got a minute 18. See if we're going to hold on here or if I'm going to lose all three of these. But this, is, this was a great lesson right here. This was a great lesson. Even though this signal candle looked, had, you know, it had its reasons. Man, take something that's close off this EMA. Take something that's close off this EMA. Now, when this candle 
gets up here, we will have a low and a higher low in place, which would be a great second second trade to take. Like if this had been my first trade, um, this is looking like a wonderful second trade to take. No, but you gotta wait for it to break here. Plus we got 40 seconds left and anything can happen. But let's see if we can get another win to get that get back them some of them losses. 31 seconds and we're pushing. But I ain't gonna make the mistake that I made right here. I'm gonna wait till it breaks above this area. 22 seconds. And and also I like to wait till it's like 10 seconds left. Okay, here we go though. Here it come, here it come. 14 seconds. Definitely shot this win in the back. Let's see if we get that second entry though. I mean another entry. It's struggling. There we go. I'm in. Alright. So now what we have here is uh so that was a first entry, second entry, beautiful, easy win. Now we have the low push up, higher low entry, and it's off to the races. You see what patience gets you? You see what patience gets you? Wait for an entry that's near this 21 EMA. I mean, man, I couldn't I couldn't teach this better. This was now this is a great learning video right here. I mean, proof is in the pudding. Two minutes to go. Let's play some music. Minute to go. What you guys think? Home run hitter or is he gonna try to come back for us? We'll see. Home run hitter. Second entry long, higher low, back to back. That's how it goes when you're trending. Look at the EMA, beautiful, beautiful angle. Couldn't even touch it, just came back and got near it. There you go. You just saw what not to do and what to do. 13 seconds to hold on though. But they messed this whole video up, this whole training up. That's how it goes. It likes to scare you sometimes, but you get a good entry, you'll be all right. That's a win. All right, all right. I'm satisfied with that, with that setup. I mean, not with that setup, with that training. That was a great, great training. So we didn't get our, we didn't get our uh, breakout pullback, but we did get a second entry long near the EMA. Then we got a low push up, higher low. Almost broke higher to new highs. And one, two, three. So two good trades. You saw the two bad ones, you know. This was just a lack of patience. It was a lack of patience to enter before the candle closed in this case. And then it was a lack of patience uh, because this whole setup in general was too far away from the EMA. So hope you learned a lot from this little run. Um, I'm using Pocket Options as my broker. I'll put a link in the description. Also, the course is out. Grab it. People are loving it. And uh, as always, I wish you increase on the Sutton. Take care.
So this thing triggered another setup. So I thought I, I would, you know, take it and show it too. So uh, you guys saw the wind here. Then it pulled back another near EMA. Beautiful candle. I took that. Look at this first candle. Woo, off like a rocket. And so we got a minute 24 to go. We'll see if we hold on so you can see three in a row. This is how easy it could be to get three in a row when you trade off the EMA and uh, and the currency is uh you know it's trending when you're in a good when you're in a trend and it was all on the day chart and I can go look at it the day chart the day chart said we moving higher there's nothing but ways to go up the four hour said we were moving up and the hour everything agreed and so there's no shock that these longs have been working. That's no shocker at all. Just take something off the EMA. So 36 seconds, and it'll be three in a row. Ooh. Ooh, hold tight, hold tight, hold tight. 25 seconds. This was a good crispy entry, though. I mean, it was a good entry, and this candle gave us a huge lead. I'm shocked it came back on us like that. But 10 seconds. Another win. That's three. That's how you get three in a row on a good on a good uptrend. There's probably another one coming, too. I mean, because it's struggling. You see the stems. I wouldn't be shocked if we make another low, higher low. This candle goes up here. That's another higher low entry that I would take. It's great. It's great, people. Just take entries near the 21 EMA. All right. As always, I wish you increase on the sudden. Like, subscribe, please comment. You know, if you gon if you gonna start trading with me and um, you know follow what I'm doing, put in the comments price action rules. All right. Catch y'all later. Okay, I'm back again. But this is the last time for real. I mean, <laughs> it pushed through hard, right? But what it really made from the high up here was another a huge first entry, second entry long right off of that range that we initially broke out of. So it had it came back and tested it like we was thinking it was going to test it, you know, here. But it, it went all the way up here and then made two legs back. See the leg back, one leg, two legs back. Couldn't break through it. When I seen this bounce back up, I knew it was going up again. Now, this is a home run hitter. Thirty seven seconds. And that is going to be one, two, three, four in a row. There it is. There it is. Again, like, subscribe, put in the comments, price, action, rules, baby. Price, action, rules. First entry, second entry long. Right off of the, test it, right off the top of that range. Be huge, beautiful, huge signal candle. And look at my entry, it was horrible because it shot off so quick. And I still won by a mile. Four seconds to go. That's the win. And that's one, two, three, four. So I, here go the two terrible ones that I shouldn't have took, right? And then one, two, three, four. And it's, it might make another entry if this, no, okay, it's, all right. It might be over now, but <laughs> great run. Great run, price action rules. We would like to thank you for tuning in to another Increase episode with JD. If you want to learn how to price action trade, please visit www.jdhider.com and you will find his brand new course, IOTS, Price Action Trading System. We thank you again and as always, we wish you increase on the sudden.